closing the gender gap uh, and female economic empowerment should be core in any strategy in any country. We should start with first political will. Political will and political support is key. You cannot have female economic empowerment without political will. And this is what we had in Egypt from His Excellency, the President of Egypt. Believing in women and trusting them and putting them in the right positions. We reach now more than 25% women in the government. Uh, they are at the core of the government's portfolios. Uh, we have more than 27% in the parliament. We have positions that were not that were restricted before for women. Like now we have more than 75 judges. For the first time since its inception, women are at the state council. So this is a major breakthrough. Also, we have the first uh, female as the chair of the Women uh, of the Human Rights Council. The second is having the institutional framework. Institutional framework in terms of strategies, in terms of decrees, in terms of reform and regulations. Uh, women empowerment 2030 is at, is at the heart of the Egypt of the vision Egypt Vision 2030. It's cross-cutting all the economic, social, and the environmental pillars. Second is having different reform and decrees that enhances women's participation, like the representation of women on boards, in the banks, in the financial sector, like investing in women, having capacity building on two fronts, on women on, the strate on strategy making positions, like women on boards, and in less privileged women, like in investing uh, in skills like entrepreneurship, like uh, uh, microfinance, uh, like digital, uh, uh, the, the, the digital transformation, and so on.